Argo Suede and welcome everyone to Argo Suede Back in Garden with me, Mitchell Juno Suede. Of course, we're here at Good Moon Farm and we're here with Aragon. Great. Aragon Decreed. Aragon. Aragon, can you give us some information about your location and what it is that you're doing here? Yeah, in a, in a short word or two, I um, have created a regenerative organic farm on the hillsides of um, Tortola above Cooper Bay and um, we grow soft crops, fruits, herbs and we grow new crops to the BVI. We're introducing new varieties and um, we have a, a farmers market every Saturday and we do have an online ordering system at goodmoonfarm.com where you can get from boxes delivered weekly and we have volunteers. This is how awesome. I met John. Yes. So <laughs> of course guys if you can and if you live in the British Virgin Islands especially in Totola and you would like to get in contact with him the information will be in the comment section i'll pin of course the information in the comment section as you can get access to that organic food of course some good good moon farm but we plant on the good moon <laughs> we, <laughs> use the, we use the lunar calendar awesome that's why and it's good to use the moon to plant that's good yeah. so of course i hope that you guys enjoy the video from henceforth i'm just going to show you some footage and some information very important historic information from of course are the real on? key to their survival was a, a crop that they brought up from south america originally with them which was the cassava which is what we're eating now we had it some of that Cassava is the kind of, um, it's a very strong st um, starch storage of energy that grows on the ground. The one you have for food is under the ground. Mm -hmm. When a hurricane comes, yeah, we, we don't even have to talk about it. <laughs> it's like a nuclear bomb without the radiation. So at least you could go out and pick the food the next day. Mm -hmm. So. Cassava is the sort of the queen of the underground, but then you've got yams, you've got dashing, you've got tanya, you've got everything. You've got sweet potato. All of those are crucial for human survival on these islands. There's enough vitamin C as seven oranges. Wow. Not nine bananas for, for yeah, potassium. What one of yeah, those? I do. Some no, no, I'm just talking like about the leaves right now. Oh, when you dry dry the leaves, you can eat them fresh, you can put them in your salads. The, the flowers you dry and you can add them to dishes and they taste like mushrooms. Yeah. They're very delicious. Now the other thing is if you have a hurricane coming, right, you can yeah. cut down this tree, you have a great food source for almost six weeks. In six weeks, that tree will give you another like whole crop. Yeah, yeah. So very it's rapid a, growing. It's gr very rapid growing and, uh, and an incredible food source. And like in a place like this where we can lose our food source for six weeks, it's a great tree to have.